Hi there. Now for this question, we're asked to prove the identity sec squared theta plus cot squared theta is identical to tan squared theta plus cosec squared theta. So if you'd like to have a go at this, haven't done so already, just give you a moment to pause the video. When you come back, I'll take you slowly through the work solution. Okay, welcome back then if you had a go. Well, in this example, okay, we'll just put proof here. Which side do we take to start with? Well, it doesn't really matter. We've got basically two terms on the left-hand side, and we've got to prove that it's identical to two terms on the right-hand side. So there's not much difference in the number of terms here, where I've generally said in the past that take the side with the most terms. In fact, with this example, it's going to be just as easy to work with the left-hand side as it is to work with the right-hand side. I'm going to take the left-hand side, though, so I'll copy that down. So it's sec squared theta plus cot squared theta. And to do this requires knowledge of two further identities. Remember, these are developed from the basic identity sine squared theta plus cos squared theta is identical to 1. If you were to divide each of the terms by cos squared theta, you would get this identity, tan squared theta plus 1 is identical to sec squared theta. And if you took this identity and divided by sine squared theta, you would get 1 plus cot squared theta is identical to cosec squared theta. I actually showed you how these were derived in an earlier video, so do check them out if uh, you're still worried about how to do that. Okay, so if we look at sec squared theta, you can see that sec squared theta is the same as tan squared theta plus 1. So pop that in there as tan squared theta plus 1. And then for cot squared theta, well, we need to rearrange this identity, subtract 1 from both sides. Gives us cot squared theta is identical to cosec squared theta minus 1. So we can put this in here, that that's the same as plus cosec squared theta minus 1. And we're straight in now with the answer because the ones cancel one another out, and you're just left with tan squared theta plus cosec squared theta, which is what we had to prove. Now, it would have been just as easy, as I said earlier in this example, if you'd taken the right-hand side, you could have easily just replaced tan squared theta with sec squared theta minus 1, and cosec squared theta with 1 plus cot squared theta, and you would have then arrived at the left-hand side here. Okay, 